you can take the deposit on the other cards for today? Yeah, I can. I wrote up a, like I told Melissa, I wrote up a, like a receipt just right. on our letterhead. Because when I looked into the, re when I researched and we checked with our regional guy, he's like, we don't know. Like, I know it hasn't it's been so a, far away. I know it is. Because they pushed off, even the 2020, some didn't get built. They'll be 2021. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so they don't know when they're actually going to start producing the 2021 model. Well, they're producing them now. Uh, but then 2021 gonna, doesn't start till Christmas. Right. And that's just regular C8s. They don't know whether they're going to have... Because that 06 will be a completely different thing. Same as allocation for us. So we may... It's possible that we get an allocation for a C8, but that doesn't mean it's going to be a Z06. Right. right. He tells me. So it could be a, a, a C8 that you get, and then we'll know whether we can... That C8 can be a Z06, or there'll be a, a second. Okay. So we can do that. So if we know that we're going to get an allocation for one C8 and one Z06, then it's yours. Okay. And the, the paperwork or the little thing that I drew up reflects that as well. So. Okay, great. Online the other day, and they say it's an 18 month wait to get a C8. For 2021 now? Yeah. I they say they say the some people it, like, it's almost at the point where you'd be lucky to get it. Probably. Not. I know we're still waiting for our second 2020 that we're supposed to get in. Is it a convertible? No, I think it's just. I don't a, think they'll get built. I think it's just a one LT. Because I know they're going to uh, convertibles now, and they're only building a hundred a day. Well, is that right? Yeah. And it's all convertibles right now. It's so hard to get information, like legitimate, solid, concrete information from anybody uh, because I don't think that they know themselves. I think it's changing on a daily basis or a weekly basis. Well, I'll, I if love you want to go, and I'll grab that one. Yeah, I'll just move this and put it over there yeah, and I'll be right good. in. Sounds good. Pause it down on the Z06. So this is what I drew up. If you want to have a look okay. at it, it basically just says what we had already spoken about. Just shows you that obviously we don't have any control over what GM tells us, yeah. but you know we take the deposit just like we did last time in trust, and once we actually go to order it, then we can uh, uh, then we'll actually take the deposit. But just like the last time, it'll just sit in the back room until we actually make the order. As soon as they tell us, we can order. Good stuff. All right. Yeah. So there's your. Is that right. So, yep. Perfect. That's good. And you sign one, and I'll sign the other. So what's your plan for the rest of the day? Uh, what are we doing today? <laughs> I have no idea. Driving around? Yeah, that's no, all I'd be doing. No big plan, just really. Around, yeah, yeah, just go where the car takes us kind yep. of thing. That's awesome. Just put a deposit down on a Z06. I might not get it 100%, but I do have the first allocation that's got Drummond Motors in Campbellford. Hopefully they get an allocation, so hopefully I can get a Z06. Okay, we're back from getting the engine cover installed now. Uh, they didn't let us film them installing it. They, none of the mechanics wanted to be on camera. So that's all right, but so here's the red one. This is edge red, not torch red. So it's not the same red as the wing, but as you can see, this engine cover, there's the black one there beside it that was originally on there. So you can see it was like a kind of dull finish, black or gray. 
with the silver Corvette. And this one here is a nice edge red with the black background and then the silver Corvette there. The edge red is definitely a lot nicer than the black one because almost everything in this engine bay is black. Uh, this is black. Everything in here is black. Everything up here is black. So when you're looking and when this roof isn't in here, pretty much the entire area back here is just black and nothing really pops out. So now with that red in there, that looks a lot better. Like I said, they didn't let us film when they changed it, but I did get a picture of what it looks like when the engine covers off. So I'll put a picture in here of what it looks like. And then I can show you, this is what the bottom of the engine cover looks like. There's like a foam that protects between those two pieces of plastic, I guess. And this one is probably going to get painted um, probably yellow. So he'll have a yellow engine cover and then the red engine cover. The engine cover was ordered with the car too, but it took almost an extra month to get here. So these things must be really hard to make or be in really high demand. I think the edge red might definitely be one of the nicest colors for the engine. And the red now also matches the uh, covers over the headers down there now too, so. We also tried to pick up the mirror caps. Um, they had the mirror caps in, but they were still currently painting them red, so they said sometime this week the torch red mirror caps will be in as well. Also, just a quick tip for any C8 owners, when you're closing your rear hatch, you don't need to slam it hard at all. Just close it gently with your fingers. And see a motor will actually pull it shut for you and make sure it's closed. So please don't be slamming your trunks. That's pretty much it for this video. Uh, probably a video coming soon of installing the red mirror caps. But that's about it. So leave a like, subscribe if you haven't. See ya.